Hey guys, welcome to Loudly Creative again. El Pais in the news. May 22nd, 2014. Vladimir Putin and Xi Jinping in Russia closed a deal on Gazprom's distribution of 25% of natural gas needs for consumption and production within China and Russia. And this deal cuts it off on a $350 price for each cubic meter engage in trade. They have been trying to set the price for 10 years and it finally took place as a positive affirmative on a go-ahead due to the fact that Russia in political and economical growth has slowed down its uh, ability to command a leading leverage upon the European Union a straight interaction within them due to the fact that the separatist movements going along their borders has weakened their position and engaged them in political views which generate a lot of debate and doesn't satisfy the Kremlin's uh, stance on how, what they think exterior opinions should have on their uh, interior uh, moving on. The European Union has also a dependency on the Russian gas and has been trying to find an alternative but later on we will cover this in another article that has hopes for them. China on their side has territorial crisis that has been dominated by the presence of an external nation such as the United States which defends the sovereignty and constitutes the Western Hemisphere's safety by providing supervision on these matters. China and Russia are not the best of friends but surely have tried to convey a moving on the union of transparent trade, communications and trust within nations by solidifying their block and borders and exchanging their goods for future growth within their relationships and trying to make an example out of what may become a future incentive to reach agreements upon nations that are near to each other. Brussels, as I said before, has also been in the news and this time when I mean Brussels I say the European Union a leading capital where their political activity takes most of uh, active stance upon being heard where they have voiced out loudly that they cannot tolerate uh, Russian boycotting of Ukrainian distribution of gas due to the fact that if Russia and the Kremlin take this positive move of denying Ukraine the distribution of the quantity they suminister to them on a regular norm, the European Union will be forced to raise their prices and slow down their economy immediately and in the long term could be forced to suffer from contractions of a negative sort. This is because the energy sector, which is connected in one-third of their providings from Russia comes straight from the linking connections that the distribution system has implied before through Ukrainian viaducts that are resourcefully fed from Russian Gazprom pipes. Ukraine has to pay a debt that is being managed to negotiations due to the fact that after the ex-president went an extradication order towards Russia, the Kremlin said that they were dealing straight with him and now the prices must go up because they have been assumed as a new controlled in power nation. Ukraine says that there is no legitimate action in the dealings of past reference to the future applications and are willing to pay but only the moderate terms that constitute what they owe in the past and not why Russia what Russia has set as a new markings of erasing arbitrarily on their pricings. The EU has not made any inferences on the fact of pricings and have left the matter as a bilateral trade agreement but have pushed to settle on the effects that this might bring to production on the eastern side, western block of increments in their manufacturing side where the Symbiosis and participation of globalized notions would affect the whole sector, not only immediately the European Union, but also the goods needed for production in the Russian North Front. Later on, in another article related to the gas crisis and the bioproducts of this dependency on a world notions in prices, 
Mexico and Spain will be taking the place of uh, development in a probable solution where the Spanish nation has a well set up platform to process gas from the Mexican region. This would allow the excess 60% of production within the Spanish nation that has not been activated to distribute a great amount of gas that may solve the burden of having to depend on Russian gas immediately. Although these measures will be just talked about, it will take a lot of time for implementation and this is why the EU moves forward fast in trying to alleviate some of the tension from the Ukrainian distribution sector directly connected to the Russian Gazprom, not monopoly, but one-third controlling of the gas solutions of the EU. Further up ahead, Germany takes another celebrative stance on the podium by having 400,000 immigrants contributing to its growth of 0.8% in the gross domestic product, recently celebrated in the first term of statistical notions given away by an agency of the European Union economical inferences. Germany is also willingly celebrating the fact that the population is becoming elderly as we move forward due to the fact that natal rates have been reduced, but this immigrate Asian wave has reduced the possibility of the mean age to further itself from the expectancy of 47 to 46 years for the following 60 years due to the fact that the immigrations are labor forces which are younger and might lessen or lessen or reduce the uh, burden on pensions for future uh, takes on the elderly. Uh, Germany also has uh, contributed in smart policies such as not allowing more than six months unemployed uh, exterior immigrants from the EU to stay within their nations, allowing them to vent off people that might be living from unemployment rates from other countries and unemployment benefits from the EU to stay there and produce not only nonsensical advancement of the economy but to stimulate emigration flow to evaluate the possibilities of having them not only there for an amount of time that not will produce but get them actively engaged in the search of their active productivity. Germany has been the leader in economical fortune for the EU bloc and is definitely also participating in the EU elections with uh, their options versus uh, La Pen and ha Holland and other nations' alternatives in democratical notions. It will be nice to see the turnaround on their political takes in the furthering weeks where elections in the EU bloc for the parliament elections will take place and it's notary to say that change is upon the European Union's perspective to comply towards action. Brazil still has the eye of the storm in their upcoming event of the World Cup where economic growth has been greatly uh, parallel to their speculation uh, reform on the development of projects which have been vaguely celebrated by the people within their domestic markets, now assessing the damages and taking advantage of this leverage they hold by paralyzing the public sector in around a 55% mark before three weeks of the commencement of the celebration of this event. Airports are now in the uh, specific and exclusive notion of the government's attendance where uh, growth has been forecasted and celebrated in the amount of visitors they have received uh, recently. For example, from 33 million uh, visitors to 111 million people are estimated to uh, be received and the millions part I am mistaken it's uh, thousands and I will correct that immediately which have also found a way to realize that the airports are not yet at most ready for the celebration of this event either or the governments have also taken inclination on saying that they're not worried about this because the functioning will go on and the event will take place but 
the private sector has taken advantage and harmed the public uh, consumption by raising their prices, for example, in transportation. It will be interesting to see how this plays out, but we hope that in no terms of making fun of an instance that may lead the country to engage in the affecting of their poverty to take place parallel to the growth of the power within the government to invest in long-term benefits for that same poverty in economic theory. It is something that has happened before but shall be of unprecedented uh, norms of compliance in the eye of statistical uh, welfare where only the letting be of capitalist notions will allow us to see the policies and merging of public opinions on the force of public paralyzation within a nation that has been growing solidly around the years. Thank you for joining Loud the Creative. I will correct the uh, numbers on the growth of uh, visitors to the airport in the bottom and I apologize for the gap and mine. This has been Loudly Creative again and tomorrow we will have the news. Hope you have enjoyed today.